I gotta clean my crap. Day two. Day two of day three. Coffee. Wake up. I got my whiskey here. Hey, wake up. I'm awake. I'm awake. I'm awake. What's your problem? Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. I don't really know why that would be the case. Can I go fix it? Well, you probably can't, but what you can do is hike out to where the wire runs through your area and report back if it's down. Then I can track down a ranger to get someone on it. Okay, I can Rangers. do that. Rangers. Remember that cave you hiked through yesterday? Yeah, of course. So, you're gonna wanna go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. It's Henry. What, you don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. But thanks rhymes with Hank. No, it doesn't. Okay, alright. How dare she call me the wrong name. Okay, hopefully uh, I got everything. I'm gonna say no way until I get down, just in case. I'd hate to. All right, let's look at the map. See where we need to go. I got an idea. I'm gonna try to jump off. Halo style. Wait, where's my outhouse? Wait, I don't. Where? How am I supposed to report? If please let me report. There's the, the pooper. I lost my baseball. Okay, where's that? Gosh, why do the trees look like they grow it up? Wait, where's the other tower? Oh, there it is. Uh, hey, I can see your tower. I suppose that means you can see me. Yeah, well enough. Okay, let's go back down to the cave. Pretty early then, huh? As soon as the sun comes up, the Forest Service really frowns on us putting up curtains for some reason. Uh, I just covered my head with my pillow. Seems to do the trick. Wow, the forest could never burn down on your watch. Can you see the communication wires from where you are? I can see the poles, but I have no idea if the wire is in good shape or not. They run a good distance up to a spot called Beartooth Point. You just need to walk along them all the way up there and make sure everything's in ship shape. Oof. Okay. Let's keep it. Oh, I can't drop down from there. What? What do you mean? Okay, I can drop down. I'm just gonna walk it. Hut. Hut. Oh, I can drop down there. Yes. Yeah, yeah. 
I don't think I can jump freely. Yeah, I can't. Oh, it's actually pretty damn cold out here. Roger that. Warms up fast. The mornings are cold in Boulder, though, right? Yeah, they are. What did you get up to down there? I mean, what's life like? Ah. Uh. Look, I don't mean to pry or anything. A lot of lookouts like to gossip and talk about, you know, girlfriends, boyfriends, whatever. I'm just, uh, just making conversation. And I'll be right back. I got a call. Uh, sure. I'm just gonna keep hiking and hoping it warms up. Hey, yo. I don't think so. Why, have you? Okay, good. No, I don't think he has any idea. Wow. Well. I'm absolutely sure. Would you? All right, I'll let you know if anything changes in that regard. Hey, sorry about that. Anyway, if there's anyone or anything you want to talk about, fire away. Well, looks like I might have lost you. You could be down in one of those valleys. Wait, where am I supposed to get the key? Was a key in my lodge? I'm just gonna be in this box out here. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I can't remember what she said where the key was. Was a key in my office? I might have to make a trip back. I'll be right back, guys. I just... Oh, there may be another way. Survey communications north of the canyon. Okay, I'm getting north, okay. Okay, that's where I was supposed to drop down earlier. Okay, survey. Okay, I was supposed to go in the cave. Uh, I can see the wire you're talking about. It looks like it's in good shape from here. We'll follow it up to the top of the trail if you can. You can head back as soon as you give me the all clear. Got it. Am I supposed to climb it? So we really can't reach anyone any other way than these wires? What else do you suggest? Smoke signals? Just seems dangerous. Well, if they don't hear from me for a few days, they'll send someone out, but I'd rather it not come to that. Ooh, what is this? Uh, hey, I found a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. I found an old notepad of, uh, I guess, songs. Someone was writing a song called Old Shoshone. Shoshone, where the sky is blue and the teens are nude. <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's just like that, except about ten times more depressing. You got me a book for life. What is this? Oh, another. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah. I 
Never heard. Ooh. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Okay then. Oh, I, oh, I can actually look at it. Okay. That's cool. Why do you open it like that? Okay. I have a feeling that that crazy dude lives in that sucky owl house right there. Just a hunch. That's just a hunch. I think I see the down wire right there. Oh, there's a box up there. There's a box. Give me the box. I suppose I haven't seen a snake or something. Slithery little snake. Alright, let's see what we can get in here. One, two, three, four. Oh, I forgot to get the last map location. Shoot. Well, too late to say sorry. Okay. Who are these guys, Ron and Dave? They're leaving notes for each other in the boxes. Is there any chance one of them was that guy I saw in the canyon? You know, the guy with the flashlight? No, they're both rangers. They're not out here this season. I didn't really know them that well, but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded. It's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid. Hmm. Ooh. What is that? A beer can. Guess what? What is it? There's a bunch of empty cans up here. Same as before? Yep. These fucking kids. Why do you think they can... They think... They Why do you think they'd be up here? Kids. Hell if I know, but they better have stayed away from our communication stuff. Don't break your feet. Oh. True ankles. Beer cans. Not in my... No communication. Hey, so the wire is definitely down out here. I just found it. That's actually good to hear. Beer cut. Someone out to fix it. Good find. Yeah, the thing is, it doesn't look like the wind. It looks like it was cut deliberately. I knew it. The moment you said you found their trash. Oh, these idiots are gonna pay. Do they realize this is how people die? I mean, what if something happened to one of my lookouts while this was going on? God forbid there's an actual fire burning out of control. What do you want to do? I want you to go find them. And then and kill them. I... I haven't thought that far ahead. That's not true. Everything that comes to mind is illegal. Find the teens oh, and destroy them. Oh, yeah? Hey, I came out here for a breath of fresh air and some adventure. What do you got? 
I think I want you to just find them and scare the hell out of them. Yeah, I'd make a spooky ghost costume, but they stole my sheets. Hmm, I don't know. Um, wait for them to wander off and wreck their camp. Something that would make a teenage girl run home to mommy and daddy. <laughs> I'll find them. Thanks. But and I'll I will kill them. Oh. <sighs> don't hold your breath. I'd start by hiking back towards your tower and just keep an eye out for anything that would lead you to them. Well, they're big into Red Eagle. <laughs> Great. See if you can find the path they took down from there. Maybe they we'll looked make back sure around towards the lake or something. I doubt they're where they were yesterday, okay, but let's... they obviously can't have gone far. Maybe this... Maybe they're close. Maybe. Maybe. Let's adventure it forth. I feel like the beer cans lead me this way. I can climb back up here, so... As you said, headed back to your tower. Two, two forks. I'm from two forks, so... I don't know why, but this way... Ooh, there's a box. Give me the sweet box. Tell me what you find about your sweet box. Ooh. I look in there and realize it's a big sweet box. Oh, it's a big box. One. Two. Three. Four. We're going two forks. Oh. Um. It's empty. I like how I don't lock these back, so the next guy has to buy new locks. Um, never mind. I guess that answered my question. Where to go, where to see, what to be after four. I guess I go to, I think two forks is mine. I guess zero forks, but, you know. I guess I'll be given two. Back to your camp. Ooh. Ooh. What is this? What was I say? Brian Goodwin. There's an abandoned pack out here. And it's not one of the teens? No, it looks like it was lost a long time ago. Well, oh, you could always go for it for supplies. Well, I am flush with ropes now. That pack was full of them, in decent condition, too. That's lucky. I mean, there's there's enough rope here that I could just leave them hooked up, I think. Oh, get this. This uh, pack came with one of those cardboard single-use cameras. With pictures left? Yeah, he only used three or four. Neato. Thank you, Brian Goodwin. Wait, wait, who? The bag had the name Brian Goodwin sewn into the top. Huh. Wow. Do you know him? Yeah, I just haven't heard that name in a few years. Was he a ranger or something? Oh, no, no. He was stationed in Two Forks, near Lookout, with his dad, Ned, three summers ago. Great kid. You can bring children out here? No. You know, I'm not a stickler for rules. They took off halfway through the summer. Is Ned that guy from the note I told you about? About the guy leaving his post? Oh, uh, could be, yeah. But I think at one point they just realized this job wasn't for them. For Brian, at least. Huh. Anyway, so it goes. Have, uh, fun with that camera. Try not to snap anything that would scar a Photodome employee. I don't know, I got a lot of hiking to do. Might get bored. Well, I'm bored as rocks, so I'll keep you company while you find those girls, huh? Two, three, four. Read. Here, I'll let you. I'll let you read it. 
on being a fossilized claw. Oh. Uh, someone found a fossil and put it in a cash box. Could be the same person who left that antler. Maybe they're leaving me an entire creature, piece by piece. I don't know if that's supposed to be like... I see a really thin plume of smoke. Okay. I didn't know if that was graphics or what. A thin plume like this is either a new fire or a campfire. Campfire? You, you think it's them? Let's go, let's go. It looks like it's to the southwest of me. That's right. If you hike towards Five Mile Creek, that should put you in the neighborhood. Keep an eye on that smoke plume. Let me know if it's getting any larger. Will do. I feel like I'm going the wrong area. She said lake. And I feel like a lake is not even near here. But, you know. Flapjack off his ass and out to repair that wire. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> what? Do you like that? This guy is the freaking king of the flapjacks. Yeah, that's solid. I'll have to keep that one in my pocket. It's all yours. Get that flapjack out of your pocket. Henry has ankles so, of a troll. Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. I'm actually married. But you're here. She's sick, and I shouldn't be here, but I am. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, sure. Look, I gotta go do a thing, but I'll have a radio. Okay, call me if you need to. Wow, I'm on top of a natural bridge out here. Really? Is it a complete arch? Uh, no, I guess the bridge is out here. Still, I think I could jump this gap to get across the canyon. Wow, you're a regular evil Knievel. Oh yeah, you should see the jumpsuit I'm wearing. <laughs> Let's go find Oh my gosh, the climbing. Okay, so I guess I was heading the right way, right? Okay, am I, s am I further or closer to smoke? Oh, I guess I'm closer to the smoke. Actually, I've lost the smoke. It's no good. What's music playing? I'm supposed to go through there. <laughs> oh, did I take a weird turn? Did I go the wrong way? I guess not. I'll save right there. I guess it's like, hey, you already saved. Well, I'm closer. That's why smoke. Well, I hope I. Okay. I was kind of afraid that I was supposed to attach some ropes. You ready to give it another shot? Do I seriously have to? To get down to Five Mile Creek? Yeah, I'm afraid so. It's quite a ways downhill from here. Uh. <sighs> Man, I have so much rope. Oh, 
like how I haven't even looked at the map, really. What does she have? <laughs> no, I She's got Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Whoa. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Devastating, especially for her, you can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, and that was it. Yeah, I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I'm happy to listen. And, you know, we'll try to have some fun this summer. I promise. How many hikers go missing in the Shoshone? More than none, unfortunately, with most of them being in this area. The thoroughfare because it's so remote. Why? I found an old flyer for a missing hiker. It just got me thinking, that's all. Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the Aspen Grove down there. Yeah, I think that's where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? I didn't. Yeah, they share their actually, I did. colony that can live for hundreds of years, even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Um, ooh. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Even those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Did I miss the smoke? Or am I close on it? I've been going the right way so far, so I guess I'm not going the wrong way. I don't see the smoke that- ooh! Torn clothes. Hey, so I found the campsite. It doesn't look good here. Uh, some of their clothes are all torn up. And they're not there? Yeah. And the thing is, their entire campsite is wrecked. What happened? I have no idea. It's pretty bad. Well, just look around. Make sure they weren't, you know... Oh, they're gone, for sure. How can you tell? Well, the girls left someone, me, I guess, Oops. a note. Well, what's it say? They're threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, uh, did you? Look, I didn't do anything to them, but it looks like someone had it out for them. Then why do they think it's you? Fuck, I don't know. Huh. Hey, I don't. I believe you. Come on, Henry. All right. All right. It's just, it's weird what happened out here. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know. But they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back. And we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too.